this gaming and speaking of, we should be getting a free PS4 and PS3 games guys and this is the newest glitch newest method ever like on my channel but guys if this method did not work for you or if you're having troubles with this it's too confusing then make sure you go check my website solitude.com with three instead of the e at the end so s o l i t u d three dot com that has a better method of your PS4 games I teach you how to get free PS Plus games and more guys but anyways guys let's get straight to this method what you guys want to start off by doing is heading over to your computer laptop you can use any laptop even a tablet might just work for this I'm not sure if you can do this on tablet but it might just work I prefer doing this on a browser all right guys also on my website you can actually do that method on mobile it's way easier on mobile so make sure you guys do check that out all right so what you want to do to start off here is head over to store.playstation.com and you want to sign in as I've done here and then guys what you want to do is head over to the uh, stores game so press games and go press all games right here and then where it says all games go ahead and choose a game uh, that you want this works for PS4 and PS3 so guys let's go ahead and choose a game that we want to get for free now for the fix video I think we're gonna do uh, a game that's already out so let's see here how do we do this PS4 full games and release date let's do price high to low and you can do any game which is just insane guys so yeah make sure you guys make the most of this Oh, Dark Souls 3, we can do that. Let's do Dark Souls 3, guys. Alright, so to get Dark Souls 3 and to do this, what you want to start off by doing is head over to Add to Basket. And you actually want to go ahead and press Add to Basket, guys. And it's going to say this message now. And what you guys want to do here is press Show Basket. Here, guys, where it says uh, Move to Wishlist 7999, on this screen, go ahead and press Move to Wishlist. And now it's going to say, is it out in your wish list? And then guys, you want to go back to the main menu screen by pressing on this. And where you can see all this. And you want to press this hard thing above the top beside your name. It's going to say this hard thing. Go ahead and press on that. And then guys, Dark Souls 3 is going to be up here. What you guys want to do now is press add to basket again. And here guys, you want to press show basket. And where it says change your 10 digit discount code. Here what you want to type is uh, your game name. So dark. Souls 3, but I'm not sure. You, I think you should just copy paste your name because I'm not sure if this works if you just do a little bit. So, yeah, you guys actually have to go to your name thing again, go into the uh, game file, and you want to copy and paste this name into this discount code. And you want to do this, and you want to empty the space, is like that are there, no more spaces, and write X. Four, which is the developer code for the PS4 after after your game name right X4 that's in here make sure it's only one game in here and then guys go ahead and press and apply also guys I just want to say this only works once but my method on my uh, website website works up limited time so it keeps on working it keeps on working also guys if you're watching this if this video hits 500 likes I'm doing a PS Plus giveaway so make sure you guys do check that out make sure you give a like I'll be hosting the PS Plus giveaway for 300 500 likes so check that shit out guys here is you guys go ahead right click apply and uh, where it says view page stores, go ahead and press on that. And here's gonna be giving you this screen, and what you wanna look for is uh, line 13, okay? Go to line 13, and it's gonna say this line right here. What you wanna go do is copy this entire line. It's gonna be different for everyone, it might be different, but it's gonna be line 13. So whatever your line 13 is, guys, copy that. All the line numbers will be on this side. I'm using Google Chrome, but you guys can check that out. Uh, just copy line uh, 13, go ahead to your basket, and where it says apply go ahead and paste this line and it's gonna say like this now it's gonna look like this and you probably be like oh my god it looks really weird go ahead and uh press and apply and it's gonna say this discount code is not valid guys here when it says this what you want to do is press on your keyboard you want to press Control shift i and it's gonna bring up this little menu guys and it's gonna say all this stuff here and you're gonna be like oh what the heck does that mean what's this count this discount code is not valid what you want to look for is like the first line up here the html class go ahead and delete that and go ahead and delete all this like stuff guys go ahead and don't delete this because you can't really delete this but you see the line that says ajax.googleaps go ahead and delete that and guys, probably gonna be like, what the hell did that to do? I didn't do anything. And just don't worry about it, guys. Now, when you press apply, guys, go say this discount is not valid. But guys, it did actually apply. And when you like, proceed to check out, go ahead and press on that. And, and where it says add payment method, you don't want to do this. Now, guys, you actually got the game. Now, go check your email, guys. You will have, not your 